And yes, I'm shutting the door, but everything is open. The valve comes out right through here. Very dangerous. But Pretty sure I just ran out of gas on the little engine. And I, like I said, all I'm doing is trying to prove something here. It's a 212cc engine enough to move the car. Yeah, yeah, you can move the car with it. Considering that engine is not connected to the wheels, it's only connected to a generator. It does work. So I'm gonna go ahead and restart it, move the car. But it does, of course, make enough power to physically drive the car around. And this actually proves a point because all I want to do right now is charge a set of batteries while I'm driving. That engine, I'm going to buy a diesel engine. I might be able to find a good diesel engine. 12 horsepower, somewhere around there to go under the hood. So, go somewhere under here with uh, another set of batteries that'll be under the tunnel. That way I've got some decent range. But let's see here. I'm gonna go ahead and get her put up. So, some progress on the electric RX-8. <laughs> Had to store some 12 volt batteries somewhere. So right now they're in the trunk of the car. Go ahead and fire it back up. I'll catch everybody later. I know every one of my updates, it's dark. This is the only time that I have to work on the car, basically, is during the night time. So, get her fired up, moved around, see what I can do with it. If y'all want to see any more updates on the car after I get the engine, the diesel engine put under the hood and a separate generator motor system put under the hood i will definitely be posting video but i don't know when it will be this progress has been kind of slow just because i don't have the time to work on the car but it being said everybody take it easy predator predator powered mazda rx8 who would have thought